And hello to you from Clydeside. We find ourselves on the south side of this great city, Glasgow. I'm Derek Ray. I'm joined for commentary by former Arsenal fullback Lee Dixon. And very much looking forward to bringing you live action from the Scottish Premiership. It's Rangers up against Celtic. Thanks, Derek. Yeah, really looking forward to both teams producing entertaining football. Let's see if we get that. Well, who will be the player to decide the outcome, to determine the course of events? No reason at all why it won't be this man, Lee. What do you anticipate seeing from him? He's really hit form of late. Defenders are really going to have to watch him. Four goals in the last three matches. the starting 11 for Rangers we think 4-3-3 but maybe with a slight difference yeah very narrow look about the team up front and narrow in midfield so both fullbacks should be getting extra pay this week because a lot's going to be asked of them going forward and defensively here's the Celtic starting 11 pretty well balanced this formation Lee yeah it can be a 4-2-3-1 in the offensive mode but he can also go back to a 4-5-1 when you're defending the lone striker will be supported by the three just behind him especially the number 10 who will be given a free roll and now they get the ball rolling Hadji and it's with Davis Giannis Hadji. Roof. Hadji. Thumped clear. Cara McGregor. Good looking ball. There could be a chance now. Not troubling the keeper. Stephen Davis, Kent, Taylor, Callum McGregor, Scott Brown, Turnbull. Can they prize them open now? Crossing possibilities. Well, space for them here. And they'll get ready for the throw in. And played in. Well, they couldn't take advantage of the opportunity. Pressing high to win the ball. Crisp tackling. Scott Brown. It is to be a throw in. Hey, Lander. And back to the keeper. Connor Goldson. And it's Tavernier. Hadji. James Tavernier. Kent. We're getting the ball forward. Unable to keep the ball. Running room in the wide position. He could pick out a teammate. And 
Scott Brown. McGregor has a go. And that's sound goalkeeping to hang on to the shot like that. They've given it away. Ayer. Taylor. Elianusi. And there it is. The opening goal. 1-0. And they'll feel they deserve it. Well, let's see that again. Oh, it's so sweetly hit. Look at his technique. Absolutely brilliant. He's got the power, he's got the accuracy, and now he's got himself a goal. The opening goal of the game then. Kamara. Stephen Davis. Turnbull. Now the attack looks promising. Alas, he's made his move too early. Offside. <laughs> Roof. A move of promise on the flank. And options in the centre. Not at all problematic for the goalkeeper. Wanted to keep it but couldn't. Stephen Davis. Kamara. Well, that is how to play advantage. Touchline for a throw in. Christopher Ayer. They've won back possession. Stephen Davis. Rangers totally in control of possession. However, after that, the coach will be disappointed with what they've produced. They need to be a little bit more clinical in front of goal. Kenny. And across the touch line, so a throw in here. Ayer. A fine reading of the situation. This attack looks highly promising. Has someone to play it to. And putting his body on the line. Well, possibilities in the centre. Roof. James Tavernier. And the ball with Roof. And he saw the situation developing. Well, in terms of added time, a minimum of one minute. Elianusi. Oh, lovely ball. Could it be? Wonderful chance. And a goal! That's his brace. They just can't keep him quiet.
Well, here's the replay, and it's a great ball into the danger area. But I have to say, after that, the keeper doesn't cover himself in glory. Near post, left exposed, and he's punished. Well, the managers will now deliver their half-time team talks. We're at the end of 45 minutes in this game. Well, we're focusing on him for a reason. He's asking plenty of questions of the defenders, Lee. Well, they've really struggled to keep him under wraps today. It's simple. His movement really causes defenders problems, and he's done that again today. Plenty to consider based on what we've seen so far as the second half begins. Callum McGregor. Welsh. Brown. And showing fine vision. Now successfully cut out. Roof might really be able to trouble them here. Hadji, what can he do from here? And they'll get ready for the throw in. Very alert defending to cut off the supply. A chance for them to provide a test in the form of a corner. Now the delivery. Teammates in the middle. I must admit, I thought he was going to score with that header. Yeah, it was a quality cross and he gets up well and it's just wide. John Joe Kenny, Welsh, Scott Brown. He's using his strength to good effect. John Joe Kenny, he's lost it. Connor Goldson. So to the keeper. Throw ins given. Here it is now, a substitution. And space for the cross. Quite possibly a yellow card as their flow was stopped. The referee has dished out a yellow card here. Well, it's not malicious, it's just clumsy.
And he whips it in. It did look on for them, but not to be. Cleared away. Welsh. Kenny. David Turnbull. Nice looking pass. Forrest. He has time to play it over. But nicely executed defensively. Can they take advantage? That is when your goalkeeper is worth his weight in gold. Well, he's earned his wages, hasn't he? He was in position. He had his focus. What a save. And it is substitution time at this juncture. Not just from one side, but from both. Corner kick played in. Well, he dealt with that ball played in rather well. Barisic. Alfredo Morelos. Ryan Kent has it. Moving the ball effectively. Hadji. That's the kind of shielding play you expect from him. That's a very impressive piece of defending. So 20 minutes to go. Well, it was a menacing attack, but tidied up. Arfield. Bonna Barisic. Kent. Roof. Not attacking possibilities. Offside, a tight one. Time for the change now. <laughs> Fifteen minutes remaining. Our field. And in possession, Morenos. And a good looking ball. Strong, really poor timing, and some will argue that he was asking for a yellow card. Certainly a tricky call for the referee. He's gone for the yellow card, although there are those who would argue that was the denial of a clear goal-scoring opportunity. I'd be one of those, Derek. I think he's very, very lucky to get away with that. Got the yellow, should have had a red. Well, as we see it again here, Derek, starting it more central and bending it out makes it really hard for the keeper. He thinks he might have this, but no chance. Look at the bend on this. Well, two one it is here.
Christie and Kenny. Well, when you can keep the ball like this, it's got to be really annoying for the opposition. In position here to protect the ball. Oh, lovely ball. Getting forward. Possession one. Deflected behind. Corner forthcoming. And deciding to go short with this one. And the referee has pointed to the spot at a crucial phase in the proceedings. He's been admonished by the referee. He's now got to walk something of a tightrope. Yeah, he knows exactly where he stands. Look at the referee, how he's told him off there. No yellow card, but serves what the referee's thinking. And he slots it home with confidence. Well, here's the replay, and this is the type of penalty you dream of. The keeper goes early, and you just slot it into the empty side. And off you go to celebrate with your mates. Easy stuff. No shortage of goals in this match. 3-1. Well, wait. Don't go anywhere. We're going to have five additional minutes. Giannis Hadji. And in possession, Morelos. They've given it away. Taylor well sloppy in possession James Tavernier Hadji it's with Goldson and there goes the final whistle not the result the fans were hoping for Lee a real lack of concentration for me has cost them today mistakes too Manager will be looking around for that drawing board to start all this again. They were poor today, Derek. Well, as we run the rule over this man's work, positive after positively. Well, clearly the difference between the two sides today. Two goals, a really good performance, ran into the channel, did everything right. Absolutely, 9 out of 10.